Ladies and gentlemen, in this first session, we will hear three different sharings from our guest speakers. Our speakers will each have 20 minutes of sharing and 10 minutes for questions and answers. Questions can be asked in English as well as Bahasa, so please do not hesitate to ask. Our first speaker is Mr. Noritaka Kobayashi. Mr. Kobayashi is the head of APAC and the vice president of GRI Singapore. He is in charge of developing and executing business development strategy in the APAC region. GRI Incorporated provides the leading mobile social networking service and is at the very forefront of mobile technology. It aims to build the leading mobile social gaming platform for users and developers worldwide. The new global platform is coming this spring to over 100 countries. In this session, expansion strategies to APAC region and the new platform will be presented by Mr. Kobayashi. Let's welcome Mr. Kobayashi. Hello, uh, selamat pagi. Yeah. Uh, my name is Noritaka Kobayashi from Grey. Uh, okay. I'm talking about this. Uh, just three days ago, uh, we just released uh, our new platform, but it's still beta, but a new one, and um, which means that. Uh, something like this apps. You can download it from App Store and Android Play as well. And then on that platform, actually we do have already 230 million users in the world, which means that uh, once you develop one games, you could reach to the 230 million users in the world. Maybe it's the same population in Indonesia. And I'm talking about this today. The first movies I show off now is the actually our one, one of the first title for the global market called Zombie Zombie. And actually, we are focusing on the only on uh, iOS and Android. Our business is only for these two platforms. Actually, we don't do any games for Java or PC or something. So it is because. What is the trend? We have several trends in the world. First one is, you can see the left one. The number of shipment of PC, actually this year, will become smaller than the number of smartphone shipment. And then smartphone shipment is getting increased year by year. That's why so we focus on this smartphone. And second one, is, you know, if you think about the web business or something, maybe five years or something, Yahoo, Microsoft or something, but actually it, they are all stuff for now. For now, people are going to the social media, social platforms, like Facebook and like us. And then here is another trend. Actually, for now, maybe all of us, all of you uh, don't know GRI very much compared to the Zynga. It is because our main business was in Japan only for now, for the just one year. And then, as I mentioned now, three days ago, we released our new uh, platform for the global market. For now, so far, our, our main revenue comes from only in Japan, but as you can see this, uh, for example, Nintendo, you may know Nintendo very well. Their revenue, 70% of their revenue come from the global, not Japan. That's why from now on, we have a potential to make our revenue three times, three times bigger than now. Then, okay, I'll talk about the another phenomenon in apps market. You heard about the two words, premium and premium. Premium is the like a $50 games, $100 games. It is very expensive. But uh, creating the, such games, it took two years, sometimes three years. But nobody knows that it gets a hit or not. 
On the other hand, freemium is free to play, free download. Anybody can download it just unconsciously. And after that, they play the games every week or every day or every minute. Then they cannot help but bring that. For example, this is the latest uh, app ranking in the US, uh, t top 25. Uh, you can see the, this uh, 20 of 25 are free to play. So developers, they try to have good games for months, for years. In that case, they write to, to sell it by $10, $20, $50, but it is not good way. Even though if you spend a lot of time to create a games, you should provide your games by free for further revenue. And then this is the, the way we have done so far. And then we think about the lifetime value. Lifetime value. Lifetime value of premium games is just once when they bought the games. That's all. But on the other hand, uh, free to play games, premium games, firstly, free to play, but uh, month by month, day by day, we could have an uh, opportunity to re uh, get, get revenue from users. And then, so to, <clears throat> uh, to increase this lifetime value, what we need to do is, uh, so three things. First one, try to make users uh, purchase our free uh, virtual items inside the free, free to play games. Second one is uh, player engagement. But we have platforms. On our platform, we have 230 million users. 230 million users will share their game result. Hi, game, we got a good, good game score of these games. They will share to the friend inside the platform. This is kind of the strong uh, ads for users. That's why we could make users' en uh, engagement increase. And then cost per acquisition, we need to get uh, new users. We need to get uh, new active users. Usually we spend a lot of money, promotion money, but inside the games, we could provide a, a, lot, of, uh, a lot of a comment like ads from the users, sending it to each other. That's how we could uh, make it more cost effective. <clears throat> so on, inside the platform, you could get a more acquisition, more retention, and more monetization. Then, so usually, without a platform, usually what we can do is sending a lot of SMS, sending a lot of email, sending a lot of banner ads or something, but just throughout, we cannot trace it correctly. It, it is not cost effective. And um, so, but with a platform, what we can do is, for example, uh, just just like one month ago, we acquired one U.S. company called Hanzio. They have a lot of users. And actually, we do have a lot of users as well. And then, for example, uh, the left, left below one is our in-house social games. Now you, sh you saw, like a zombie zombie or something. We have users, active users. The company Funzio we acquired just months ago, they have already users. Once you develop a games on our platform, you have games on our platforms. And then we provide a notification ads inside the games, from games to other games, other games to these games. It's very effective that. So if you learn better ads on a Yahoo or such a portal site, most of them are not a game player, but inside the games, inside the game ads, we have a more chance to notification users. For example, uh, this is a Turista, is a fishing games that we created for the first time. It's a social games. It was released five years ago. And amazingly, we still remain get revenue from this game for now. And it's still increasing 
every day. It is because、uh, we have a platforms. This is the example image of the these fishing games. As you can see, it's very simple. It's a games for Japanese customers. They do not very beautiful graphics. They do not very beautiful CD, 3D games. But、uh, these games is get a、uh, more revenue than such a great CD or a graphic games of a console. It is because we have platforms. We could engage users to access a platform. We could engage users to access our, our platform again and again. That is because we provide uh, uh, the such ads between the users, or we provide a social event in inside the games. We refresh these games every week, every day. That's why every time they ask to our games, they feel they feel it's kind of new. That's why, although we released it five years ago, we can do that. And then、uh, maybe now we have a lot of platforms. We have a lot of social network, social network、uh, services. We have a lot of social mobile game platforms so far. But what is the difference? We have a, both of game focus and social. Network focus on mobile, and then maybe Zynga has the both one, but the Zynga, in terms of the social network services, Zynga rely on the Facebook. In terms of the platform, Zynga rely on the PC. But we have both social network services and the game focus on mobile, and as you can see now, from now on the number of A、uh, shipment of smartphone will much much bigger than PC, and we have more than five years experience on the PC. That's why we believe that、uh, our platform is the most attractive one for game developers. Okay, from now on, I just introduce my company more briefly. As as I mentioned now, we have a platform. On the platform, we have advertising business. We have、uh, in-house self-development social game business. As well as we have a lot of third-party gamers, a lot of ga developers provide their games for us for, on our platform, and it's kind of revenue share model. That's why any developer have a chance to get revenue through our platforms. And then this is the, our performance result.、Uh, Uh, left one is the number of subscribers we have. For now, we have 230 millions. Right one is the number of games we on our platforms. Then、uh, you think that、uh, we are pretty big, but we just established our company eight years ago. Only eight years ago, and for now we have 1,500 employees. Our annual revenue is like a two billion USD. So anybody can do have such a chance. Just I think just do it. Okay, this is a abstract of our platform. I will skip it. And then now I'm I'm come from the Greece Singapore. And I'm based in Singapore now, and I'm in covering a whole Asia area to enter this market and exploring developers, promote them、uh, to create their social games for our platforms. Then, so, in, once you provide your games on a platform, we provide a lot of service for for them. For them, like、uh, for example, the analytics. Uh, we developer can use a、uh, great analytics on our platform. You can get a lot of informations, how many downloads, how many active users, or something. So you can self check your game's result daily basis. That's why you could have a chance to revise how to revise your games to get more users to get more revenues. And this is the. Uh, example about we create the games. Now we showed at the first of the, this presentation. Actually, 
although this is the first global title, we got a, a top fourth ranking in the U.S. of free free games, and as well as a top ten ranking of the in the U.S. grossing by by these games last month. So uh, inside the platform, we have a such chance to be like this. The, this is the another example uh, called Alien Family. This is our counter game ag against the uh, Zynga's Farm View or something such as this. And also, in terms of our third party partners, these brands already announced that they provide their games, their good games on our platform. As well as uh, from China and Korea, these companies are already announced that uh, they provide their games on platform. It means that these games will make a platform more activate. Then once you provide your games on, on our platform, from these games to your games, we could provide a lot of notification ads between users. Then for now, we have 230 million user bases. But our maybe vision, like final goal, is creating a ten, 1 billion community. Through the, this community, we provide a fun, entertainment, and we try to make the world a better place through the communities. And so maybe a lot of developers coming today, so we are waiting for your games. We are waiting for your, uh, your developers. Thank you. Uh, so, someone has uh, any questions about uh, GUI or games or something? Okay, nothing? So, don't, don't hesitate to come to me and uh, have a question to me later, it's fine. Thank you. <laughs>